1997, a strange and loud sound was heard in the Southern Pacific when researchers were on lookout for volcanic activity underwater. These researchers used hydrophones to record the sound, which occurred multiple times, was heard from more than 1,500 kilometers away, and it was unlike anything they have heard before. What you are about to hear is the sound captured. Due to the unique characteristic of the sound, it was dubbed the bloop. The interest it has garnered over the last two decades has made it one of the most exciting mysteries of the ocean. Who or what is responsible for this mysterious noise? Although the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, or the NOAA, were curious to find out where this originated from, the vast majority of the deep sea is unexplored, and therefore many resorted to theories at first. These theories range from secret military exercises underwater to an unknown sea creature. One of the ideas that garnered attention was that the sound originated from a giant squid. Others thought that it came from a creature with a squid face. Cthulhu, the mythical beast created by H.P. Lovecraft, is imprisoned in the sunken city Riley, which is located just over 1,700 kilometers from where the bloop was recorded. This excited fans of the author and the mythical beast. A little more believable theory was that the sound originated from a group of whales. However, there is one main problem with this theory. No group of whales have been recorded to make noises that could be picked up from stations 1,500 kilometers away. Nearly a decade after the noise was first recorded, scientists were able to explain what had caused this. The NOAA believed that it is the sound of a common event, which is the cracking of an ice shelf of Antarctica called an icequake. Robert Ziak, a NOAA seismologist, said that characteristics such as the time duration and frequency are very similar to that of the bloop sound and are almost identical to the ones recorded off Antarctica. He also pointed out that it is very unlikely that the sound originated from some sort of animal under the sea. This is due to how the sound of the bloop is played back, which is 16 times its normal speed, making it sound like a vocalization of an animal. Although the case has been closed by the NOAA, Many around the world still do not accept that the bloop was simply an icequake. Where do you think the sound of the bloop originated from? Mm -hmm.